Yo, what's up, my name, my name is uh, Jonathan Ark, and um, I'm trying to get my last name, so nobody's <laughs> gonna get it. We're pretty much uh, exploring, or trying to see if we can have any supernatural entities in, in uh, John Human's cabin. Yeah, from 1819. Yeah, like I said, it was built in 1819, so pretty much it's about a 200 year old house, and um, we're gonna see if we can get anything. Yeah, I think they, um, I think they're just upstairs or something, they're like an attic. Try walking on that, it'll fall through. <laughs> so, I've been here before with the dowsing rods, and I was a bit scared, to be honest. What do you notice about this, like? I don't know. Probably looking for, like, ectoplasm. Ectoplasm? Nah, I'm like, you're looking for rakes. There's a noose. By the door. I should probably. There's so many cars here. Isn't there only one car here? There's like two now. I like three. Three. Anyways, we're just gonna keep going unless they come in here. Then we're gonna take a break. Basically, is what is up with this lighting? I don't know. If the lighting's messing up. It's the ghost. Oh, it's spirit. Well, I mean. Won't the, won't the camera static if the ghost was me? Well, see... Or is that more of a demon thing? We'll find out. Ooh. So basically, this door is the main thing we focus around, sort of. Kind of. Because there was a picture of a couple getting their picture taken, like, right outside on the stone steps right there. And in the picture, there was a misty figure of, like, a person standing, peeking out at them. And so, yeah, we think it's like John. Wait, your name's John, too. Yes, my name is Yeah. So, his grave is up there. Hey. Hey. Are y'all pictures in here? Mm-mm. No, we're... The fact that you told them we're looking for ghosts. Call me, call me honest. <sighs> so there's a lot of graffiti in here, obviously. It's kind of sad. Yeah. I wonder if it makes the spirit angry of people. Well, when he sends his tombstone over there, and his body, was his body ever buried? Was it cremated? Was it what? Um, I don't know. If it was cremated, it wouldn't be in the ground. I mean, unless they wanted to bury the jar. Okay. Just because the grave's over there doesn't mean he's attached to his grave. It could be like attached here. I mean, this is his house, so his soul could be. What ghost could be attached here? But, yeah, was he buried? I mean, I would think so. Unless he wasn't, and they're just lying, and his grave is open every time. They usually do if they can't find a body or if something happened to him. You know what's weird? The little square, I hate this because when I went to the Sears parking lot in the haunted place, I told the spirit to move my little square thing in the camera to where it was. And it did. So the thing is right there where the ghost is. Let's see, Mr. Joseph Adam Lee. Holmes. I wonder what his name is. I don't see anything on a John Neilman. Hillman? Hillman. <laughs> yeah. I don't know why I said Neilman. He's already offended. <laughs> By the way, that tree had weird energy. The big one, this creepy one up there. Um, By the bench, yeah. You sure that's not light? No, never mind. Maybe it's not a memorial. I mean, some country people used to plant trees as memorials for people who have passed. Really? Yeah. You didn't know that? No. See, found it. Right there. Uh -oh. I'm Christian human. Yeah. I knew it wasn't crazy. Yet. Hang on, you said you died around 1800s, right? Yeah, it had to be in the 1800s. That's in 1959 through 1967. Well, that place was built in 1801. When we go back, we gotta check that. If his name's up here, and it says that he's part of this club, then... He should be around 140 years old. <laughs> 140, yeah. 150 years old. I have no idea. And why does that grave look new again? I swear it was all dirty last time. That is scary. <laughs> Louis Matilda. Mm. What? Louisa Matilda? 
Lisa? Where are you reading that? Here. Oh, I'm blind. His daughter. Oh my gosh, they're all buried here? I guess. JC and JC Hillman. Jesus Christ, I'm sorry. <laughs> John Christian Hillman. Oh, yep, that's it. Is there anybody else? his wife's name. Oh, I kicked a stick. Uh, whoa, that's a, both, love that. If they're both JC, then I'm just going to Jane. Maybe Jennifer. Jennifer. Jennifer something. Jennifer Christian. So he was born February 3rd, 1840. Wow. What? She only lived for about two years. Oh, maybe she was a child when she died. Let's see, 1800s. There was a lot of disease back then. Oh, uh, yeah. A of, not a lot of kids survived. When was the Spanish influence? When did that happen? Was that um, the 1900s? I'm really basing this off of Twilight, too. Oh, I love that tree so much. Spanish influenza? Yeah, that's what I meant. 1918. 1918? Okay, well. There was some other disease that was like around that time. Maybe it's, um, not, well, tuberculosis, yes, you would cough. Whooping cough? I don't know. I think it just spread around all the children and caught it. We think that this child died from whooping cough, maybe. Did you know exactly what year it was? It was just in the 1800s? Mm -hmm. Yeah, throughout the 1800s, it was pretty much smallpox and cholera and tuberculosis, whooping cough, and influenza, among others. Take this. Okay. Okay. If the spider jumps on me, I'm gonna die. So there is an energy over here. Yikes. <laughs> yeah. You got any EMFs? Yeah. What? What? An EMF? Is that what this thing is? This is a... Let me see what put... I don't know, hold that. Yeah, this is what an EMF is. A spirit box. Yeah, okay. So it has one bar left, so we're gonna have to... to use it a little bit over here. Yeah, it's got batteries. It's like AAA, and it's... We don't have those right now. Okay. So let me put this in, because we're gonna have this. All right. You know how to use it? Uh, probably not. How do you turn this on? Power. Oh, of course, power. Oh, sweet forward. Okay, you recording it? Yeah. Okay, wait a minute. What was that? It was the thing. Well, that one's the one we use to speak to it, so we might want to use that one. The first one. Yeah, it works. <laughs> All right, we we can't. We have to let it run for a few seconds, to, like start sweeping the channels. There we go. Turn it up a little bit. Same volume. Yeah. Is there a spirit here? Is there anyone here? <laughs> I'm sorry. Wait. I'm sorry. Say that again? They said no. We're supposed to introduce ourselves. Oh, okay, okay. Wait, we're, we're not here to cause any harm. Like... Are you scared? This is music. No, it, um, yeah, that's what it is. It sweeps through the radios and it takes the signal from that and uses that to communicate. It really works though, like... But what about that no part? The no part was what we asked. Yeah. Is anyone here?
still music, okay. Music again. Is anyone here? What was that button? The sweep forward. Okay. Well, that's a good volume to take because the phone has to pick it up. Yeah, there's no other one. We're good. Okay. Um, is John yeah, Hillman sure. here? Yeah, you you sure. got to... Yeah, I'm going to try something. Who is, whose gravestone is this? Or whose memorial, marble memorial stone is this? <laughs> you know you gotta have the antenna up, right? Okay, let me ask her. Hold on, wait till that car passes really loud. Okay. Um. I'm not feeling any answers. Let me see. Jeez, the music. Are you mad that we're here? Is anybody here? You wanna try FM? Oh, we're on. Oh, I think we were on FM. Is anybody here? Well, that doesn't work. Okay, we're not getting any We're not getting any answers right now, so we're gonna save this rest of the battery for over there. Maybe the I feel like the no was something though, because I mean that scared us both. Yeah. But yeah, um any type of music it stops on and like it's clear enough, that's what it's saying. It uses the radios to speak. Oh, so it's gonna be like that. It said it needed help with everything. Did you hear that? <laughs> Pretty much using bumblebee language. I guess so, yeah. Alright. Is anybody over there? Nope. Said, like, no, I need help with everything. Along the lines. I know I'll watch back and see what it actually said. You know, sometimes when you look back at the footage, you can hear other things that you didn't hear in real life. I mean, and whatever, you know what I mean. Everything, then it, it still must be here for unfinished business. It means it's a ghost. Yeah. So it's here for unfinished business. Yeah. They usually they usually stay on earth. They usually stay here if they have unfinished business or if they came for revenge. Mm -hmm. So what I'm thinking is that since I'm thinking that it's still unfinished business. I don't know which go I don't know who ghost it is, it could either be daughter or maybe John but no, that'd be kind of weird if it was a daughter then we're definitely not gonna get any answers if it was a daughter then what kind of business or how to live out through her life or... yeah I guess so or but I don't know oh love that wait while we're here yeah, that was kind of 1849. Oh, I lied. 1849? Yeah. It's okay. weird. So it's only 170 years old. Okay. It smells like skunk. Yeah. Which is not good. Yeah, that one gets real messed up. No, I mean, like, it's close to sulfur. Sulfur? Yes. Demon what? Yes. Did you not smell it? No, I smell it. 
What are you doing? Sulfur. Oh no! I don't think. Okay. That's the noose I was talking about. Sulfur is usually yellow, right? Uh, I didn't know it had a look. I thought you just smelt it. Oh no, you can see if it's sulfur. It could have just been like the mud or something. Could be. Yeah, sulfur has a distinct smell, distinct color, and it's always a powdery. It's always powdery. Hmm. Oh man. You want to do it in the area that the thing was right here? Uh, sure. Okay. Yeah. Um. Effects of getting possessed, right? What do you mean? Like. If you get possessed, there are different effects to it. Like what? Intense aggressiveness, depression, anger, um, screaming. Well, screaming. not like, ah, I'm gonna kill you. Not like that. Just like getting Oh my gosh. We didn't say goodbye. We can do it here. We didn't say goodbye over there. I was about to say, wait, what? No. You looked over here. No, I was thinking. Okay, let's try this. You want to be the one holding it? Uh, I can hold, uh, I'm holding the camera. Oh, okay. Hmm. Well, make sure you get me over here. Okay. Okay. Right. Get anything? Alright, so. Nobody over here can again. Is there anyone here? Are you male or female? Who built this house? You sound intimidating. We don't mean any harm. Yeah, we don't mean any harm, we just... Can you repeat that? Is anybody there? Yeah, hang on, try FM real quick. This is FM. AM's like... Oh. Yeah, try AM in it, sorry. Is anybody here? What is today? Are you stuck? That's just the wind, right? Is that your gravestone up there? On the hill? I'm sorry, what did it say? I need help. Are you angry that we're here? Freaking truck. Oh, 
Okay. What is your purpose for being here? Do you feel vengeful? Okay. Did you die of natural causes? Don't think I'm thinking we should have done this during the night. Yeah. Because they are more active in the night instead of the day. Well, that wouldn't happen. Like, I'm gonna be like, you are not driving in the dark. Yeah. Alright, let's see if they're still coming here. Okay. Let me get them. Is there any energy in here? Um, did somebody die in here? Okay. Wait, wait a minute, hold on. Let's try that again. I think I was holding it wrong. Let me hold it like this because I can't block these things. So, wait. Get them steady. Did somebody die in here? Um. No, no one died in here. Then why is your spirit here? Okay, hold on. Wait, we don't know that yet. Wait, hold on. Um, wait, wait, wait. Let me get him back in position. Is that... Do you know whose grave that is on the mound? Okay. Um, are, you the, are you the daughter? Of John Hillman? Um, Wait a second, I have a good question. Um, Louisa Matilda, that was her name. Louisa Matilda. Okay. Um, Louisa Matilda, do you know? Wait, hold on. Let me try that again. Yeah. Is it, that. Yeah, you go. Yeah. Is this Louisa Matilda, John Human's daughter? Let me see if she knows who the person was standing here in the picture. Okay. Do you know the figure or spirit that was standing in the doorway in the couple's picture? Okay. Ask if it was John Hillman, but wait a minute. Uh, was the figure John? Was the figure your father, John Hillman? Standing in the doorway. Yeah, was he standing in the doorway? It's a no. It's like a undecided thing until this one moves all the way back. 
Yeah, it means no. So I wonder who that was then. Hmm. Okay. Is oh wait, hold on. Is there another spirit in this cabin? Oh boy. Okay, let's stand over here. I say try standing in the middle. The middle is usually the strongest point. It's either the corners or the middle. So make sure the lighting isn't crazy. All right, yeah, all right. That's what we got. Lighting yeah, normal. That's good. Right. So I'm gonna stand back a little bit because I don't want people to see my ugly self too close. <laughs> so, um, what's the question? Um, let's see. We know that the, we know that it wasn't John in the picture. Oh. The bug. Is the other spirit that's here bad? Wait. Oh. Wait. Oh. It's not a spirit then. It's a demon. Well, we don't know that for sure. Well, yeah, I don't know. Is there like another name for like a bad spirit? I thought they were just, I don't know. Um, no, they're, they're either vengeful spirits, um, spect uh, specters, or, well, specters are usually the ones that um, get revenge, that possess a person and use that person's emotion to get revenge on the person that they hate the most. What, well, am I just gonna randomly find that person? They can possess anyone as long as they have that item. You want to try? Sure. Hold up like this, right? Yeah, just make sure your hands aren't touching this thing and hold them a little bit uneven. Like, hold this one up a little bit. No. Yeah, and make sure that they're, like, calm. There you go. Is it? Okay, um, do you know the second spirit? Yep. Okay. Um, Ask if they're near us right now. Oh, do you want me to ask? Okay. Um, is the uh, second spirit near any of us? We already knew that was a yes anyway, so I just wanted to see if it would say yes. Okay. Um... um Wait, say something like, you know we're not here to cause harm, right? Just make sure they know that. Um, are we a threat to you? That's how you word it. Hang on, do you think we are a threat to you? Shoot. Oh boy. No, just, um, well, we need to... <laughs> yeah, we need to clarify on that. Um, yeah, we're not... Just so you know, we are not a threat to you. Um, my name is Jonathan, but I go by John. This is Hannah. Hi. Um, we are not a threat to you. We're just curious and we wanted to see who was here. I've been here before. Wait, hold on, give me those. I, I need to ask it a question. Or, I don't want to call it it, sorry. Well, we know this is Louisa and whoever is with her. You don't know if it's Louise. It could always be lying, but I'm not going to accuse her of lying. Okay. But, okay, um. Well, hang on, if this is a demon, then, um. I don't think it is. We must want something again. Okay. Okay. Um, ooh, that feels nice. Love that. Did you feel that? The coolness? Wait, hang on. You said this smells sulfur, right? Yeah. You know there's mud, stinky mud out there, right? Yeah, I know, but still though. I I've been here before, and there was, like, I don't think there's anything bad. But, um, um do you remember me from last time? Well, that's good. Yeah, maybe. Um, I'm scared to ask this question because I don't know if that thing from Sears has been like quietly following me the whole time, but I haven't. Why did? Why does it feel like it is? Or no, but um, I don't want to associate and put two spirits together. So good idea. Well, actually, are you sure that um that it's following you? Because I mean, you said that. That that spirit died there, right? 
Yeah, uh, well, mm, no. He, the spirit that I was talking to at Sears, he murdered the woman that died there. Okay, did and he, okay, did he take her corpse? Did he, um, take it? He slaughtered her. He, like, ripped out her stomach. Ew. Yeah, and then he got put to a death sentence. Okay, well, thank gosh for that. Um, yeah. well, did he take the body or did he just leave it there? He left it there and they found it. He, she was hanging upside down in one of the tents. Yeah, um, okay. Ghosts, ghosts usually hang around where their body is. Are you a demon? Wait, okay. Freak. Yep, um, no, we're not waiting. We can't do that. Um, okay. Okay, if this is a demon. Um. Well, if it's a demon, then as long as we make it clear that we're not here to, like... This is a demon. We're not trying to... Well, we don't really know that for sure. Right, hang on. Um, hang on. Uh, Make sure you're filming what you're doing. All right. Wait. All right, hang on. Oh, Lord. Right there. All right. Um, can you do something for us? Okay. Um, I want you... To pick up that little twig, or are you trying to call the poltergeist? Pick up a strand of, or pick up a few strands of her hair. Dude. What others like? Wait, you know. Gotta get. It's all bug and it scared me. Or you should word that different, like like word it differently, like static, I guess. Okay. Um. How would you want me to word it? Just make her hair static, but I don't know if I want to get possessed. Okay, how about we ask a different question? Okay. Um, cause... Man, I wish I brought my ball. <laughs> oh, go. crap, that wasn't smart. Yeah. Do I have, like, a ball or something? No, oh, we have the clackers. We can use that. Tell them to move one of the little clacker thingies. Good idea. I knew they were... Tell them we're not leaving without saying goodbye. Okay, um, I can hang on. Um... We're gonna have to go get my clackers. Yeah, well, she is. I'm gonna stay here for a little bit and see if there's anything else. Hang on, okay. hang on. Let me see the uh, thingies. Let me see these real quick. Okay. Um. Hang on. Let me see if I can do something. Okay. Let's see. And hopefully. Are you a demon? Is this your final answer? How are you doing that? Okay, we are dealing with a demon. Huh? We are dealing with an actual demon. Did you like turn the camera around? No, I didn't. Okay, that scared me for a second. Yeah. Okay, so. It could not be though. Well, I mean, I asked if it was it was its final answer. Both said yes. So. Well, one question you never ask if whatever you do, just don't ask anything about it, like harming anybody, because that will actually happen. So, let's see. This is a very bad idea. The clacker? Yeah. I'm gonna pull my shoe back on. Let's see if. Could you move the clackers for me, please? Wait, hang on. Let me try to position this. Alright, put a. Can you move the clackers for us, please? That's a yes. I 
ask its gender real quick. Or say, like, are you female, you know? Are you a female? That is, yes. Yeah. Okay, so ask her if she wants us to move back while she moves them. Like, oh, wait, no, if I leave the camera here and we walk out, will she, like, if we walk out, will she move it? If... Um, do you need any space? <laughs> okay, so let me see your shoe. Well, you might need your shoe. Yeah, it's okay. Maybe he's going monkey foot. So it doesn't want us to go outside, we just ask. Maybe we should move to that corner. Can you move it now? Just say yes. Okay, do you want us to look away? Look away and close your eyes. Give me like 10 seconds, okay? You want to count down? I don't know if it moved. All right, do you want someone to pick them up? Can we test something real quick? Sure. I'll pick them up, because let me pick them up first. Um. So how I tested to see if it's really, you know, actually working, it's not just saying yes because of weird stuff around. Um, ask it, um, ask her if your name is Marcus. Marcus. Because if it's not and she knows your name, she'll say no. Okay. So do it. Uh, is your name Marcus? No, your name. Uh, oh, wait. Is my name Marcus? Oh. Um. Is my name Marcus? Go over there. That's clearly the wrong answer. Now try it. Oh, your finger, you're holding it wrong. Don't let your pinky fingers touch it. Just hold it like that. Um... Is my name Josiah? Give it time. Is my name Marcus? weird are you still here I don't think you also talk anymore did I scare you oh my yeah we scared him or her oops I mean I've gotten that multiple times <laughs> I've actually gotten, I've actually gotten, you're scary. You're scary. Am I loud? Um, 
Hold on. Um, here, take the camera, and I'm gonna try something. Okay. <coughs> okay, I got one. Um, ask if my shoes are red or, or blue, or any color. Are Jonathan's shoes red? I think that's kind of a no. Maybe they don't have like clear vision of what we're wearing. Probably. That's probably what you're saying. Um, I got a good question. Wanna ask about the death? Death? Um, Tuberculosis, cholera. I'll do that after this question. Okay. Um, are you more com- What did I just see? Sorry, my vision just is really weird. <laughs> um, are you more comfortable talking to me than you are with Jonathan? Ouch. No, I mean, I don't think that's a good thing. I'm like, um, I have natural energy, so that means like this type of stuff is attractive to me. So you're kind of safer than I am right now. Um, at least they're not like, why don't you ask this question? Wait. Are you angry with me? You better believe that this ain't a vengeful ghost. Okay. We don't know that. It, I could just be different, you know. Um, so let me try. I'm going to try to answer no question just to see if that we're not crazy and we're really talking to you. Mm -hmm. um, all right. I've done this one before. Okay. Not like today. The wind. I gotta wait for this. Yeah. You do know where you're standing, right? The middle. For the past. For that, for the last one, we've been standing in the corners. Maybe she's more focused in the middle. Um. All right. It is my name, Mackenzie. Okay, that's enough. All right. Let me try this. I know you know this. I'm just trying to see. Um. Is my name Hannah? We have communication skills. Good. Um, um, I don't want to ask any questions that's going to make her mad. Like asking about her death probably would make her upset again. Because remember, she was angry earlier. Hang on, ask if she's angry again. Maybe. maybe... I thought I did. I said, Are you angry with me? Oh, well, with you, but are you. But ask well, if, she's... if she's angry with anything like like if she's angry at all like like does she feel anger or any hate do you feel anger towards anyone besides us Told you. So, I don't know, we're, we're probably not talking the same way. Wait a minute. Hang on, ask her name again. What's her name again? Louise Matilda. Louise? Mm -hmm. sure? Yeah, Louise. Louisa? Yeah, it's Louisa. Are you sure? Yeah. L O U I S A. Are we still talking to Louisa? See, told you. And I feel cold now. I'm my hands in the middle. Do you not feel it? No, I mean my... Right here. I don't think that's good, is it? Depends. I don't feel anything. Sure it's not just the wind? I don't know. You never know. <laughs> okay. It's still recording, right? Yeah, it's still recording. Okay. Yeah. Oh, I feel like I just felt something right here. Oh, wait a minute. Okay. I have a question. See that show the news? Mm. Okay. Yeah. Alright. I'm going to get away from that over there. I'm going to stand really fast. Mm -hmm.
Does it bother you that people vandalize this cabin? Heck yeah, I'd, I'd, yeah, I'd I mean, even pee on ghost too if, I, if my stuff was vandalized. Let me get away from mm. my face this way. Mm. Um, did a human draw the noose on the wall? Okay, good. <laughs> Great. <laughs> Did you live here? Yeah. And this is Louise Matilda, right? Well, I think. I yeah, I asked her if it was still there. No. It said no, remember? So whoever Check if it's John. Huh? See if it's John. Oh, okay. John Cri wait, sorry. John Human. Yeah, John Christian Hillman, is this you that we are talking to? Okay, so this is John. Hi, John. Uh, His name's John's too. Yeah, John, meet John. Well, John's We're my nickname. Friendly. Yeah, John's my nickname, so, uh, you know, hi, wherever you are. Oh, my hair static. Okay, just checking something. <laughs> yeah, I would I would tell you if there's something when I do. Okay, just Okay. So take these, you're gonna ask the question now. Okay. Alright, John. Um after you ask a couple questions, I have a question for you to ask. It's not scary, it's just the regular question. Hey John, um... Don't annoy him. <laughs> are you nice? Well, he's nice. Okay, that's good. Um, ask, ask him if he was Native American. Hey John, um, are you white? Good. He could still be Native American though, um, so we know that he's white. Um, Please don't make him mad. I am not a part of this. <laughs> no, I'm just are you Nate? Are you? Are you a part of any tribe? Were you, Were you part of any Native American tribe? Yeah, that means he's not responding to that. Um, ask him if he's willing to communicate um, with us through the spirit box thing. Okay, um, are you willing to communicate us through the spirit box? Maybe we should tell him what it is. Spirit box is a little meter thing that helps us listen to you. It channels through radios, so you would use the signal from the radios to speak to us. Um, would you be willing to speak to us through that? You don't have to. I wonder if there are any Wendigos over here. What's that? A Wendigo? Oh. I don't think I want to know, do I? Let's just say they're fast. Nice. And deadly. Nice. And they can only be killed with fire. I should have brought my. I almost brought my lighter too, but I'm not trying to kill anything. That's the thing. I don't want to kill anything. Oh, fire isn't going to affect the ghost as long as you, as long as you burn the body or whatever that's or whatever they're close to. Same for a demon. If you burn the body. <laughs> yeah, the Wendigos are pretty much cannibalized Native Americans that chain. That went through a um, process through cannibalism. And now they're like these fast, now like these lightning fast monsters that eat humans and live in dark caves. Eat humans? Oh yeah. Yeah, they're they're 
claws are as sharp as knives. They're smart. They can sound like humans. They come out during the day and night, and they can only be killed with fire. Sounds like we need to call Ghostbusters. Oh, Ghostbusters is, yeah, that's not gonna help them. <laughs> yeah. The but, camera's going weird. But they will attack humans if they're alone. Well, we're not alone right now. <laughs> My chest hurts. Um, are you the force that's compressing on Hannah's chest? Oh, great question. Oh. Ooh. Uh, hopefully this isn't too personal, but, um... I hope you do not ask something stupid, John. Please do not get us killed. Okay, I already fine. can read your mind. Okay, then, never mind. I won't ask that question. Oh, um, good gosh. But I like seeing, I like asking stupid questions. He's probably, like really old. <laughs> he should be old. He's about 150, 150, being 40 years old. Mm -hmm. Alright, um, I'm trying, I'm trying to think of a question. Do you want us here? Oh, wait. Oh, you're only Oh yay! Love that. Okay. Um. Mm. Ask if he wants us here for a good reason or for a bad reason. Okay. Do you want us here for a good reason? So I don't think we're dealing with a bad oh, one right now. Sure. Um. Are you screwing with us? Why'd you ask it like that? Are you messing with us? Is better. Yeah. Are you messing with us? See, you made him mad. Don't do that. That's stupid. Sorry. You just whacked him off. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. He didn't mean to. It's fine. Trying to um, Okay. Uh, um. Oh, that scared me. That moved the whole cabin when you did that. Is this cabin light? Not a lot. Wait, ask if he can actually see us right now. Um, can you see us? That's good to know. Um, are you standing beside me? I think they're standing, you know, everywhere. Technically, there's spirits everywhere walking the earth. It's just the ones you talk to. What? So, I wouldn't freak out too much yet. Mm, I got one. Are there, are there more? Is there more than one spirit here? Okay. So we knew that. We just wanted to see. Which ones tell the truth? The one that was when we asked if your name was Marcus or whatever, that one wasn't very, whoever that was, wasn't. Pretty sure that one was just so screwing with us. Yeah. Um, okay. um, if we stay completely silent for like a minute, will you speak into my phone? Or show us, give us some sort of sign that you're here that can be, like, seen. Oh, definitely, yes. So let's just kind of chill out over there and see if... Do you have a timer? I have one here. Uh, we'll... Alright. I'm mean, gonna start now.
stairs look mighty tasty. I feel like we're running after Maybe that was a test. Yeah. Could be. Okay. Um. Did those deer look tasty? Oh my good grief. Sorry. Oh, I'm so sorry. <laughs> I sounded so country. Okay. For real. Like real talk right now. Oh, hello. <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> I'm sorry. Hold on. Okay. If I look back at my camera footage in the audio, will I be able to hear what we asked you to do? Will I be? Okay, um, hold on, ask if they would like me to stop filming in, he in here. Um, would you like him to stop filming? Ask if we can film up by the grave. Mm -hmm. Could we film by the grave? Please? Yeah, please? He seriously mean no harm. Ah, crap. Okay, so this person does not like our technology, does not want us to film in here, by his, here or by his grave, and is... Oh my gosh, what was that? Uh, that was a couple. Oh, that scared me. Am I talking to John Hillman? Jeez, John, you're so racist. It's because no, I'm. No, oh my gosh, no, he did it's not. It's because of NATO, that. isn't it? Huh? It's a joke. He's not gonna understand that. He's from a different generation. Oh wait, 1800s. Weren't they race? Wasn't slavery in the 1800s? Did you own slaves? But for real though, did you own slaves? No, Jonathan. You're I, I'm sorry. I have to ask. Let me, I'm gonna ask if you're making him mad. I need to know so we can fix it. We need to know. <laughs> can you please try to show us that you're here again? With your voice. Am I talking to a good spirit? If they could get my iPod, put it up over that, uh, leave it, and we'll walk out and see if anything goes any further. I don't know. Okay. 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 Okay.
Do you want us to leave? Something's messing it up. Are you still there? Hello? Do you want to try? Is there anyone here? Can you hear the sound of my voice? Can you hear me? Do you want us to leave? Are you lonely? Will you talk with me? Is there anybody in the attic? Is there anybody there? Probably my phone getting too close. Do you want us to leave? Maybe they want me to set it down? Do you want me to set the spirit box down? I don't know. Do you want us to leave? What? What's that? I don't know. Do you want us to leave? You know, let's go back to the grave. Turn that off. A lot of people chose Tom Legend in the woods now. And all the coaches are going up. Oh gosh. Them. Almost died. <sighs> all the coaches are going up against them. Dude. Isn't that? Oh. They're the best people. Why did I turn off the camera? We just heard a voice and there's nobody over there. It came from the cabin. Is there anybody here? Is this your grave? I don't think it's a stray. Oh, wow, dog. Uh, is Louisa here? Okay. Okay. Um, do you need help?
Is anybody over here? There's nothing. Are you trying to speak to us? Did you say Mac sticks? I think it's a track sticks. Well, some kind of sticks. Are we even talking to anybody? It's not working. Hmm. Maybe if I walk, hold on. I'm about to go walk by that too. Last time I hear the tree had weird stuff. Like, I was talking to it and it answered my question. <laughs> Ooh, we can sit here, I hope. Is there anybody at this tree? Things are shaping up to be pretty odd. Yeah, I don't think this is gonna work. Okay, well, let's just say goodbye. Alright, um. Turn this off. Alright, thanks for having us over. Um. I don't know if you were here or at the cabin. Thanks for communicating. Um, we're gonna let you rest now. Um, thank you and goodbye. So. I'm Victoria. Insta victory. Wait, so have you done this stuff before? No. What'd you think? Pretty fun. Did you get scared? Found the time. I panicked. Would you do it again? Yeah. Great. I'd already do it in the dark though. Yeah, that would be fun. Uh, well. I'm always gonna say something. I'm gonna end the video. This is the end of the video because we've done all that we can. We got a few answers. So. <laughs> yeah, I thought it was fun, but I got scared and almost got killed. So. You only tripped. That's not getting killed. No, not that. The compression. The depression? No. Well, yeah. Like and subscribe the video. And if you want us to um, go to any other place, then... Comment. Yeah, then comment. Are you mad that we're here? Something like family and help me find everything I need. try to run. I don't. You can't hide from her. You can't run from her. She'll have you by your ankles, dragging you down the hill, where she keeps all the children. Don't do what we did. Don't burn the board. Good night and good luck.